I don't even have my seatbelt on right now because I just had to get out of my van at that stop sign. <laughs> oh man, I have no idea what it was, but my hair fell down and everything. This gigantic bug just flew in. I have my window down just a little. This gigantic bug just flew in and I swear it was, it was on my head. So I just, I shook my head like a dog. <laughs> my clip went flying. Oh my God. Woo, that freaked me out. It freaked me out. Oh, I don't know what it was and I don't see it, which also freaks me out. It's like, did it go back outside or is it in here somewhere with me? Hey guys, it's Lori. I have a Dollar Tree haul for you today. And guess what? The truck just pulled in. <laughs> I should have waited until tomorrow. What do I want to start with? Boring stuff? Maybe. <laughs> I got a box of these little snack bags. The Glad brand, and there's, it's a bonus pack. There's 29 of them in here for a dollar, so I thought that was okay. I don't use a whole lot of these snack bags, but a couple days ago, I went to grab one and my box was empty. So I just grabbed this little box right here. And I also grabbed a box of these Scotty's tissues. And it's a pretty good sized box actually. How many's in here, 148? Yeah, um, I'm actually gonna keep these in the van because I always have a box of tissues in here and it's getting pretty low. It's almost empty. It's down to where when you pull one out, it, the next one doesn't come out it goes back down in so there's just a little bit left in there <laughs> anyway okay I also grabbed oh this is stuck okay <laughs> I also grabbed this soap dish with suction cups and this is for Chase he said the other day that he wished that he had a soap dish in his shower so there you go now he does I also picked up some seed packets they were 25 cents a piece are they always 25 cents at the Dollar Tree? I don't know. They might be. <laughs> but I just picked up a couple different varieties of green beans. I grabbed some beets, some Shasta daisies, and two packets of petunias. I always buy a lot of petunias at the greenhouse, so I thought, why not try and start my own? Honestly, I've never had great luck starting my own seeds but I've only ever tried it once and it didn't work out so I never tried it again and I don't even know what I did wrong but nothing really came up so I grabbed a loaf of bread this is a pretty big loaf it's a 20 ounce loaf nature's own butter bread sounds all right to me in my last haul I showed you these towels that I bought it's, there's just one towel but the blue and I got two of them in my last haul I got another one because we're using them and we like them they're thin if you like a thick towel then this is probably not gonna be something that you would want but we like a thin towel it's absorbent it works for us we like them so I also picked up three gray ones so I'm gonna get rid of some of my old dingy towels and replace them with those why not we like them so yeah oh this bag of party mix. This is for Hayden and he usually, I probably shouldn't let the kids keep snacks in their rooms, but I do. I don't care. I really don't. He, he'll eat a few of these maybe in the evening or something, whatever. I don't know, but I do. I let them keep it in, in their rooms. So it's got corn chips, barbecue corn chips, nacho flavor tortilla chips, fried cheese curls, and pretzels is what's in here. So there's that. And I also grabbed a pair of little tongs. These, I like to use a pair of tongs when I make my iced coffee. I use coffee ice cubes, and as soon as you touch them, you have like the coffee on your fingers, and I have to rinse my fingers off. So, not like it's a big, huge deal, but I usually will grab my tongs. I usually have them hanging on the side of my cabinet, and they're real handy. I just reach up there, grab my tongs, and grab my ice cubes out with those. And I don't have to rinse my hands. And I don't even rinse the tongs either, I just hang them back up, so. <laughs> Anyways, that's what these are for because oftentimes they're in the dishwasher. So now I have another pair. 
And it has this little slidey thing that, I don't know, I guess you keep them closed with it if you want to store them in a cabinet or something, but I don't know. I'll probably take that thing off. It's going to bug me. So anyways, now I'm dropping things. All right. There we go. I also found these. I looked all over for these for the longest time and finally just gave up on it. I finally found some of these little wax paper squares to put in between burger patties. You can put them in between steaks, chocolates, taffy, use them to wrap like candies at Christmas time or whenever you make candies. And they're decent. They're pretty decent. So yeah, just wax paper squares. There's a hundred in here and what do I do if I find something I like? Do you guys know what I do if I find something I like? I buy two. So I got two. <laughs> yeah. Uh, I picked up a couple of these. I also bought two of these. A green one and a blue one. They are calling them lunch storage tower. Okay. Yeah, it's just for different snacks. This part you can put whatever in here and then you can unscrew this and it's got this little container in it. You could put like celery, peanut butter, something else, I don't know, three different kinds of snacks and take it with you. I think that's pretty cool and I got this for Hayden and I do have two grandkids. I don't see my granddaughter very often but I got two of them so yeah there's those and I also picked up two more of these puzzles. Uh, if you watched my last haul, I got two puzzles. These are different. They are larger. So this part is larger, which I'm going to use this part. I'm not sure. I'm not sure which one I'm going to use for my project, but I'm always talking about projects. And these have a couple of stars in it that I'll use. And they're a little bit bigger than the other ones. So yeah, I was happy to see those. And this is something... I got some of these frames. I got six, or no, three, four, five. I got eight of these. These are, I don't even want to say it. You know what these are for? A project. <laughs> I don't even like these. These have been in this Dollar Tree for ever. These never, ever sell. So, and there's still some left. I didn't buy them all. I got eight of them. And all I want is the frame. What I really wanted was the smaller sized canvases so I could use the wood frame from those, but I have not been able to find any canvases in my Dollar Trees. And I have some canvases at home, but they're the larger sized ones. So I can't use those either. I already got some frames for this particular project that I'm talking about, but they are not the right size. So I should have brought them with me and just returned them, but oh well, whatever, it's fine. I also grabbed some of these, uh, are they calling them a pencil cup? Yeah. This is a big pencil cup though. Jumbo. Can you see that? There's a glare. Jumbo pencil cup. I got four of these. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to, I got two more of these signs too. If this one, this sign says wild at heart. I got two of them and I already got some of these in my last haul as well, but I'm going to use those for something else. And these are actually I think I might, I'm going to paint them and I might just put hooks in them or I might just attach these right to it. I'm not really sure, but I thought that would look good um, to store all my markers and stuff in at my desk in my, in my craft room that isn't finished yet. <laughs> I can't hold them up there properly, but three of them will fit across here. So I don't know if I'm going to attach these right directly to it or if I'm going to put holes in these and then put hooks in the wood. I'm not sure how I'm going to do it yet, but anyway, that's what I'm going to do with these. And I'm, I think I'm just going to try and put that together as soon as I get home. That way I'm not sitting around with another project that I haven't started or finished. <laughs> oh my goodness. All right, let's get these out of here. I guess they're sitting on my dashboard, but I got some flowers full of flowers. Yeah, I'm, th I'm posing for a thumbnail. Yes, I am. <laughs> anyway, I picked up six of these and there's two. I have two of these white ones. Can you see that they have like the squiggly things on them? They're kind of neat. They're calling them mini mums. Mini mums. 
So I haven't seen these before. So I went ahead and grabbed two of these cream colored ones. And this color, I got every color that they had. There's a little bit darker color and a darker color yet. So yeah, uh, and they all have like the squigglies coming off of them. I think they're pretty. So anyways, yeah. And I am absolutely not ready for fall yet, but when you see stuff for fall right now, I'm gonna grab it because I might not find it again, you know? These are another thing that I got that are fall, and I've seen these, I saw these last year, and I don't think they ever actually ran out. I did not, however, see this one, this color. I like that color a lot. And I think that's gonna look pretty with all my fall stuff. So I will probably sand this side down just to get rid of the glitter because I already have, I have glitter all over me actually. And I'll probably just peel these stickers off and use the back side because I do like the colors, but I think those are real pretty. So anyway, there's those. Oh, gonna have an avalanche. I also found a couple of different dream catchers a moon shaped and a star shaped and it's funny me and Hayden were just talking about dreams yesterday and I think I'll just let him pick whichever one of these he wants or he can have them both if he wants to put in his room so yeah I like them I like dream catchers anyway but those are kind of cool a little bit different it looks like this just got really dark so hopefully everything's good with the video quality <laughs> oh my goodness all right I also found a couple of different kind of owls. I've never seen these before and they're like ceramic or whatever, like glass, some kind of glass, I don't know. But I think these are really nice. And they also had one that was, this one has, if you can tell, it's got kind of a greenish tint on its ears. And this one's just mostly brown, but yeah, he's got like a greenish tint to him. There was another one that had a reddish tint, but I just wanted these two, so. All right, and I also saw these pumpkins with initials on them. I'm Lori, my husband's John. <laughs> I just like them, and if I wanna turn them this way, I can, but if I don't, I could turn them this way, and those look really nice just from the back, so yeah. I like those and they're I don't know what they're made of some kind of I don't know resin maybe or something I don't know I don't know I'm probably lying to you okay just a couple more things and that is everything I have never seen face masks at Dollar Tree before but they do have face masks it's a two-pack I got four two-packs they're very, very thin. I can tell they're very, very thin. So, yeah, okay. Two disposable face masks with ear loops. All right, so anyway, I thought these would be nice to keep in the van. John can keep a couple in his car. Maybe we can throw a pack in the, keep a pack in the van, a pack in his car, a pack in the truck, and a pack in the blazer. So yeah, we have four vehicles right now. I don't know why, but we do. <laughs> well, the blazer was Brendan's, but he ended up, uh, oh, I don't want to open it. I thought maybe it had one of those things that you can just, that's sticky that you could just open it and feel them. But anyways, yeah, Brendan got himself a car, so he doesn't drive the blazer anymore. The last thing, I saved my favorite thing to the last. So you're going to have to tell me which thing was your favorite. And maybe it's what I'm about to show you because it's my favorite just like a blast from the past socks they're knee-high socks I love these they look retro don't they I love them I'm definitely gonna wear these socks I think they would look cute like with a night shirt <laughs> a nightgown or a night shirt on but whatever whenever I have pajamas on at home I'm not trying to really look cute anyways I'm just trying to be comfortable but yeah I won't wear these until winter time, but in the winter, I'll definitely wear those. I like cute socks, fun socks, and those are definitely fun socks. All right, guys, that's everything. Thanks so much for watching, and I'll see you tomorrow.